rants and raves. Camp Lejeune toxic water that I drank and bathe in. I was stationed in Camp Lejeune in the summer of 1980 and lived at a place within called Courthouse Bay for over three months. I was in school for diesel mechanic maintenance and I lived in the barracks on base. I drank the water there. I bathed in the water there with no idea that I had thousands and thousands of men and women were being poisoned by the water. I did receive information throughout the years showing concern for me but not admitting guilt. Now there's a lawsuit and I do have a law firm trying to get me compensated for this issue. So far it's been close to two years and nothing has happened on my end. Now if I have cancer or show some sign of medical illness because of the toxic water, then I can receive a settlement. So what the frick am I supposed to wait until I am freaking dying of cancer or some of the many illnesses before the government figures out what I'm entitled to? Who's to blame? The federal government, the United States military, and a privately owned dry cleaner contaminated the groundwater near Tarawa Terrace and had not point with dangerous chemicals from 1953 to 1987. I need help with this. Thousands of people, both military and civilian, were affected, and I want to get the word out on national TV that this isn't right. Please contact me with your comments. Well, I wonder how many people are going through that just because they're not showing symptoms yet. Good luck, guy. Share this out, guys.